Okay, right. So our course is ATM 430 machining process. So uh, today we are going to discuss uh, milling cutter. Right. So milling cutter uh, generally it is a tool which is used to remove the material from the workpiece. Right. So in the form of chips. Um, generally it is used in milling machines. Right. So uh, milling cutter is a tool. It uh, is a milling machine like used for obviously uh, we will remove the material right so unwanted material we will remove the unwanted material from the work pieces right so uh, we begin with normal culture right so uh, generally uh, milling cutter has a uh, two types one is a spiral another one is a helical teeth right so uh, plain milling cutter it has more than three by four inch of width right so if it is a width, uh, width one or one mm one inch and the length of the it is more than a uh, 3 by 4 more than uh, it is a general procedure right it may be differ but generally we follow this uh, length and width right so it is made by the two way one is a helical another one is a spiral so spiral is nothing but our plane so uh, from this uh, figure you can easily observe that this is a plane milling cutter right or spiral right so general normal or a gear right so it look like a gear so gear length teeth teeth are right so here we have a uh, T slots, right? So, we have a key base, so it is used to connect the spindle. Key base, spindle, right? machine, la, machine la spindle, la, uh, key slots, right? key slots, la, the key way can control it so that uh, the power is transmitted. So, spindle to motor, uh, spindle to tool, can be transmitted right? through this uh, key base, right? So, uh, this is uh, plane, uh, plane or spiral. This is to be a helical, right? So, helical in the sense. We already seen a drilling machine. So, normal culture of drilling tool, we saw that a helix angle. So, helix angle is somewhat inclined angle, right? So, if you draw the perpendicular line here, if you draw the perpendicular line, it has some inclination. So, the edges for the arena, it has some inclination with the perpendicular line, then it's a, it's a helical tip. But here, the plane milling cutter, there is no inclination. Inclination angle is to be a zero, right? So, there are two types spiral as well as helical. Spiral, we can say it's a plane, right? Right, so this is again uh, so plane, uh, plane milling cutter. Uh, one is a plane spiral tooth milling cutter. So this is uh, plane milling uh, plane. So uh, plane. So it reduces. Uh, it produces a better and a smoother finish. So it will generally produces better and smoother finish. Requires uh, less power and uh, to operate. So operate under less power under the So this one is a helical. So now marking a triangle. So helical. Uh, especially described when milling and uneven surfaces are with holes in it right so uh, in the plane spiral pakka general na, surface vandu flat ta irukku end the uh, differentiation illa surface la there is no differentiation uh, peak pathinga appadina it should be a negligible appadina then we go with plane spiral if it is a uh, peak peak and surface or peaks la pathina romba high ah huge ah irukku some maximum minimum ah irukku appadina generally we use uh, helical right so helical use pannuvanga again uh, this is used in uh, Vertical, right? So vertical building lays uh, one This is also used in uh, vertical, right? So difference, right? Okay. So now we go. We go to discuss with the Naman culture, right? So in the Naman culture, uh, again, uh, uh, the first thing. So I begin with the outer, so outside diameter. So maximum diameter, right? So the cutter length, maximum diameter. I go. Other we say it's a outside diameter. So next time is pitch. Pitch of pitch in the sense, uh, if you take any one of the point, so if you move the radial distance, if you move the radial distance, if you move the radial distance, radially, it will touch us in the point, like for example, in the edges, like a point, so if you move the rotation, or, or distance, move the distance, if you move the distance, if you move the distance, if you move the distance, it's a pitch. So pitch is the generally angular distance, right? So angular distance between uh, uh, one point uh, to uh, between successive layers, uh, successive teeth. So successive teeth or teeth. Like, for example, so from this image, na engke edtrumo abina. In the point le edtrige, so engke consider ponra. If you take na in the point le edtrige abina, yek engke in the point le move ponna abina. Again, this is also pitch. So if me ida or teeth le, you need to assume one point or point to assume ponra. Next time the point le ande adatta teeth le aray point aray mari aray position le point set ponna abina. Under aray distance it's a pitch. So, uh, in the inference is enna abina. So, if you calculate, right? So, if you calculate the pitch of the uh, milling cutter, uh, right? Pitch calculate ponna abina. It is generally equate the uh, number of teeth, right? Because uh, one pitch la one teeth rokum, 
right so for example uh, here i have a pitch pitch number count pandren so this is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 right so we have a 12 pitches of a number of teeth evlo irukum appadina 12 because uh, generally uh, or pitch la pathinga appadina or teeth undu accommodate aagum so pitch of the teeth uh, second patho appadina depth depth abindrathu again uh, it's a linear distance right so linear distance indrathu for, for example in the teeth irukla the teeth la in the point la in the point in the linear distance we say it's a depth of cut depth sorry depth of tooth tooth oda depth depth so in the vertical such a pair vandu it's a face face of the tooth right so it's a face of the tooth in the question is a face uh, so face uh, pitch and then uh, depth so in the face correct pandra in the point pathinga appadina it's a land the land endrathu again we see in uh, drilling drilling tool bit le test drilling le paathirappo or narrow structure le irukum the same only so here the land the land pathinga appadina it have some slope so if you consider in the land pathinga appadina it's not a straight it's not it's not be a straight some uh, konja slope a irukum so adula or pre konja slope a irukirathu we say it's a primary clearance angle because we provide the clearance so chip removal kaga we provide the clearance angle primary clearance angle sometimes we have another one slope so okay here one or one slope or and then we have another one slope that slope is called a second clearance angle right so clearance angle abindrathu and the land vandu if if you if you draw the circle right the outside diameter circle draw panna abina outside diameter and the land vandu some angle la deviation aagum or slope irukum in the slope dhaan pathinga abina it's a primary clearance so first slope irundhuchina primary clearance and then we have an or particular portion ku appra again we have another one slope inner one slope irukum that is called a secondary slope sorry secondary clearance angle secondary clearance angle again uh, next one is the, this one is to be a keyway i said already it's a keyway it is used to connect to the tool in the spindle so spindle la key slots irukum in the key slots la the keyway current ta connect pandrom so it is used to transmit the power uh, the next one uh, here also we have a rack angle and then clearance angle so clearance angle la we see uh, primary as well as secondary rack angle abindrathu again uh, you, you need to find the center line so if in the milling cutter la center axis eduthukuren or x axis or y axis in the center axis na abiy mela draw pandren uh, the land the face irukla the face pathinga abina it is uh, inclined with some center angle uh, the center uh, axis la konjam inclined aagum adha rack angle so nama anga nama orthogonal cutting mode la paathu povom rack angle it's a angle formed between normal direction of rotation cutting normal line to the face of the tool so ingiyum in the face vandu the face of the tool in the normal line ku some inclined a irukum that is called our rack angle rack angle so if you want to see the width width venum appadina you need to see the uh, end view right so end or side view paatha appadina you can see the width right so, uh, so this is what uh, what it is uh, milling cutter normal cutter so here the cutter pathinga appadina uh, slope uh, helix la irukku na straight ah irundhuchu appadina we say it's a plane right uh, spiral inga axis spiral or helix nu kuduthirukanga but angle irukku so it is a helix angle so we have a helix so idha uh, generally normal culture oda uh, milling cut oda normal culture we will see one by one the pitch so pitch refers to the angular distance between like or adjacent teeth so pitch abindrathu it is refers to the angular distance between like or adjacent teeth so angular distance so if you consider this is the angular distance so pitch refers to the angular distance between like or adjacent teeth so or point enga edukromo and point adhe point adutha teeth la consider pannu appadina and the angular distance we say it's a pitch so we see uh, how many number of pitches present in the milling cutter it reflect the number of teeth so the pitch is determined by the number of teeth generally if you if you measure the number of teeth number of teeth measure panninga appadina then you can find the number of uh, the number of pitches you can say pitch venum appadina you need to measure right the face of the tool the tooth face is forward facing surface of the tooth that forms the cutting edges right so face of the tooth abindrathu forward facing so idha forward facing the rotation ipdi irukum rotating so this is what forward facing the forward face of the tool we say it's a face of the tool it will form the cutting edges so the cutting edges abindrathu land um face um meet pandra point da we say it's a cutting edges land um face um right so face uh, the tooth for face is the forward facing surface of the tooth that forms the cutting edges so cutting edges are being the cutting edges the angle at an angle on each tooth that performs the cutting right so cutting edges are being the uh, we can say it's a uh, land and face the intersection of land and face 
or we can say it 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 may some kind of angle la irukum right so and the angle pathinga appadina uh, and the land and the particular angle cut pandra than we say it's a cutting cutting edges right uh, the cutting edges in the angle on each tooth face that performs the cutting so land again it is a narrow surface behind the cutting edges on each tooth so land abindrathu it is a narrow surface narrow surface behind the cutting edges so cutting edges ku back side la or narrow surface irukum adha vandu it's a land rack angle again the rack angle is the angle formed between the face of the tooth and the center line of the cutter so uh, rack angle abindrathu idhu or center line varira in the center line la irundhu na enna pandra appadina again i will draw one uh, imaginary center line so the angle between the normal line to the rack face or face of the tool so angle between normal line to face of the tool adha enna solrom appadina it's a rack angle rack angle solrom so again it's a primary clearance angle so primary clearance angle i said uh, land as a some uh, slope with uh, that outside diameter outside circle diameter draw panni or circle varaya appadina the land is uh, definitely it, it will uh, make some angle some slope irukum adha it's a primary clearance angle at particular the primary clearance angle is the angle of the land of each tooth measured from the line tangent to the center line of the cutter at the cutting edges right so uh, or normal line varanchu appadina tangent la irundhu or slope la irukum that is what primary clearance angle so secondary clearance angle indrad this angle divides the land of each tooth and provides additional clearance for passage of cutting oils and chips so secondary clearance angle again Uh, land uh, we have some another one angle so land lay inna konja slope la irukum that is we say it's a secondary clearance angle the angle defines the land of each tooth and provides additional clearance if you want additional clearance you need to provide this right so uh, it uh, it provides the additional clearance for passage of cutting oils and chips so whole diameter is nothing but uh, the uh, the whole diameter the inner so it's a whole diameter uh, it is uh, used to connect the spindle so if it is a whole diameter uh, 10 units abina spindle with the 10 units and you can you can easily connect it. the power if it transmit down with the help of keyway right so keyway abindrathu again it's like a one slot so anga or key slots irukum keyway slots irukum so near the slots la you can directly connect appo da enna avuna rotate pandra pa power und you can easily transmit so we have another one term called heel uh, so heel abindrathu in the land in the land again and the face um join pandra Uh, and the surface na we say it's a heel so heel abindrathu the joining face joining surface between between land and the face so heel abindrathu joining surface uh, between land and the face okay so this is what milling cutter nomenclature